the world feels insecure when the leader of the most powerful country in the nation says to another sovereign nation that you wouldn't survive without us for two weeks. Yes. The world feels insecure about these things. And one has to take responsibility and one has to take this sort of political posturing to task before we talk about security in the Middle East, security in the Gulf, security here and there. The problem of security is a global problem. It's not just about Muslim countries, it's not just about Muslim nations or the Middle East. I feel very insecure when I see the rising tide of Islamophobia in Europe, when in fact Muslim minorities have tried their best to integrate into the societies in, in which they live. They uh, follow the laws and rules and regulations of the country, countries in which they live. They contribute to that society. They speak the language. They know the culture, history, and everything. But they are still seen as outcasts. They are still as seen as troublemakers. And they are still stereotyped. They are still stigmatized. They are still alienated uh, from the larger society. I mean, I think a recent example was uh, the German-Turkish football player Mesut Özil, when he had to give up uh, his role as a player in the national team because he felt so much pressure from racist circles.